Never mind. Someone's coming up the stairs. I was going to say something, but... Nope. Oh, the dogs are back. Two really good things. So last Saturday, um, my friend and I went over to Art Lee to pick up my nail polish and makeup because it's getting cold outside and we didn't want them to freeze and burst. So I was able to do my nails. Did them yesterday. Another really good thing is that I'm going to be taking a rock climbing class next semester and I needed rock climbing shoes. Not only that, but there's a rock wall um, boulder place in the university gym which I have a membership at and if you have your own shoes you don't have to pay to rent them and they're five dollars every time you go in and I needed shoes and uh, I managed to find on Craigslist some practically brand new shoes that are my size they're five and a half women's and the woman gave them to me for seventeen dollars can you believe it like seriously I'm hardly believing it myself Honestly, I don't really know why I decided to vlog. It's already almost 6 p.m. Uh, today, but I mean, those are some cool things that happen. I'm already registered for the spring semester, so I don't have to think about it anymore. Do you like my nails? I kind of copied Sandra no Sekai's nails. Hers are a mint color. She posted a photo on Instagram, and I was like, oh, that's a cute design. So I did them. They're all mine now. I just got finished editing a vlog from two weeks ago. My editor was behaving very badly, so I decided to just stop for now. <sighs> I'm still wearing my new climbing shoes. I'm liking them a lot. Maybe I'll go rock climbing tomorrow, we'll see. <laughs> Why did I just do that? <laughs> I started getting kind of tired while I was sitting there, but now that I'm laying down, I'm not tired at all. Just telling you that the vlog I'm putting up, that you'll probably see before this one, was filmed two weeks ago, and I've been working on it slowly this entire time, should tell you how busy I've been with school. <gasps> and I have to read a novel. I was supposed to read Musui's story by Monday. It's Saturday night. I started it last night, but I didn't get past the introduction. <sighs> And, uh, a couple other awesome things happened recently. Yesterday, I had my first fall spiritual counseling session, and um, next week I'm going to have my first tea ceremony training session, so I'm so excited about that, oh my god. <sighs> and I practiced my flute a little bit for it today, decided I'm going to sing. Maybe I'll sing that song for you guys. <laughs> I had a pimple, I just popped it. Now it's just bugging me because there's a lump there. Anyway, this was a really short vlog, and I'm sorry I even bothered you in the first place. And But I'll see you later in the next one. I've got stuff to do, so I'll take these off. Put on some actual walking shoes, go for a walk, listen to some music, you know, that stuff. Come back and read. So I'll see you in the next video. Yourselves. Soon the era of pumpkin will fall, and the northern winds will whisper. Peppermint everything. Ninja is coming. So the other day when I left you off on my really short vlog of doing nearly nothing just because I wanted to talk about how I can do my nails now and I can rock climb for free because I don't have to rent shoes, right after that I took a walk to the Missoula Fresh Market and bought three pumpkins. I'm hoping to be able to carve them soon. I'm thinking something intricate and cool, like, I don't know. Maybe a mandala or something? Something really pretty. And maybe I can paint the pumpkin too. But anyway, pretty soon um, Joe should be back and we'll be going to the chiropractor. I don't know why I decided to vlog today either because nothing exciting is happening. I have midterm test on Friday. I have my second exam in Japanese tomorrow, which I am totally prepared for. And um, I'm not being facetious. I mean I am. I really am. <laughs> <laughs> and then maybe I'll do some other things, but I do have a lot of schoolwork to do. I also would like to take my gym stuff and those new shoes over to the gym, get my locker set up, and then um, actually work out. Because I'm a berry colored chub today. And I'd also like to try uh, climbing that wall. These two are anxiously awaiting the return of their mother. Quite a few things happened since I left you guys earlier. I went to the chiropractor, um, and then 
Joe has two vehicles and she's been driving one or the other around and she hasn't had someone to go with her to go pick, bring the other one back so I went and got like she took me to her other car I got in that car I went and got these these nail wheels so that I can know all of the colors I have without digging through my nails I mean without digging through my polishes Ugh. and then I went to the gym and made some use of those climbing shoes that I got yesterday the other day it was Saturday wasn't it the climbing shoes I got Saturday and now my hands and my forearms are stiff. I can't make a full fist without it feeling super stiff, so <sighs> that's pretty much it. Now I'm gonna paint those nail wheels and nothing else, really. I've got class in the morning, I have an exam, and I'm pretty sure I'm gonna ace it. I think I'll be just fine. Done it! So last night after I returned from climbing on the rock wall, which has got me so incredibly sore today, I returned to the house to paint my nail polishes on these color wheels. Oh, Alice, why is your hair like this? I was just laying down. I'm cold and I'm tired and I'm sore. So I have three wheels, this one's only half painted, of my regular nail polishes. You know, the ones that you have to wait to have dry. Um, I didn't realize I had so many. Each of these wheels has 18 nails on it, and this one's got 11 painted. That includes this one. It's got a little shimmer. And then there's my gel wheel. These ones are not gel polishes, I just wanted a rainbow. But because this is the gel wheel, I covered these in a gel top coat. You know, for turds and turtles. Usually what I do, because I have so many regular nail polishes and so few gel polishes, is I just paint my nails like normal. I use a gel base coat, and then I paint my nails like normal, and then I'll use a gel top coat. Usually that's how it goes. And it works just fine. It's not like you have to have all gels to have it be a perfect manicure, because, I mean... Look at these nails, bitch. Are you jealous of my left hand painting game? I bet you are. But I know you're not jealous of how my hair is right now. Now, when I go to the store, or when I go to Japan, um, I'll take these with me so that I don't buy duplicate colors. I'm usually pretty good about not buying the same color, but, um... If I end up with a ton more, it's going to be more difficult. So I just went to the dollar store um, before class. I just got back from class, actually. But before class, I went to the dollar store to get mouthwash and shampoo. And I got that. I got mouthwash and shampoo. These have new type of packaging that looks weird to me. I don't like it, but I'll roll with it. But guess what I also came out with? Two new nail polish colors. I just can't be helped. Now I've got to add it to this unfinished wheel. This one's kind of a purplish gray, very muddy lavender, and this one is a hollow glitter. I know that buying nail polish at the dollar store is pretty iffy, but LA Colors is actually a pretty good brand. Um, and they always have a ton of colors at the dollar store, so <laughs> sometimes I get them there. <sighs> Let's test them out and see if they were worth it or not. Start with this weird purple. Ooh, I like it. It's like purple clay. It's like that dark, almost purple stoneware. Oh, fuck. Rock climbing has made my arms weak. Ugh. There we go. And now the hollow. Pretty awesomely shimmery, motherfucker. This is just one coat of that hollow glitter. Fuck yeah! Obviously, y'all can see I have a problem. Ah, uh -huh, yeah. Another thing that's happened is that last night, the internet went off. Which isn't that weird, I thought it was probably, you know, like, related to just this house. But it turns out, across the entire city of Missoula, the internet is down. So right now, I am deciding whether I want to just sit here and edit the previous day's vlog so that all of this flows together nicely, or if I should go back to campus where the internet is working and do my homework. I can do some of my homework without the internet. It's just preferable that some of it requires, like, some of my homework requires the internet. But right now, like, I don't know where in town besides the mountain campus um, that might have internet. Like, I don't even think the coffee shops do. <sighs> That's my dilemma. I want to stay here, be warm, climb into bed and keep reading, or go to campus. Or cram all of the things that I need to do on campus into tomorrow. Which do you think I should do? I'll tell you tomorrow which one I decided. 
Anyway, ta-ta for now. Never mind, the internet came back on. I just checked because I wanted to um, just connect and t see. I just wanted to connect and wait and see if it would connect, you know, without that little triangle. And I just connected. The triangle was not there. And I got online and it's working. So I'll be able to do my homework here. I'm not going to go anywhere then. And I'm also going to look up a design to carve onto this pumpkin. And my other two pumpkins, because I have two in the garage. Pretty excited about it. The ladies I live with are excited about it too. So we'll see what I come up with. And if I can't come up with, find anything that's similar to what I'm thinking, I'll just make it up. I'll wing it. I'll see y'all another time. Kyoba, suiyobi desu. Last night, I only got about this far on my pumpkin. See, I got the little holes around the top, and I have this popped open. I didn't pull the guts out yet. So I only have these two parts of my mandala, and I've decided to put namaste on the front. That's as far as I got last night before I had to go to sleep. I didn't sleep as long as I really would have liked to, and I should have. I have tons of studying to do, and I came back not that long ago because I am hungry as hell, and I have to go to work in less than an hour. So I came back to eat, and, well, I'm cooking some carrots. My two absolute most favorite vegetables in the world. Broccoli comes out on top as number one, and carrots are number two. Hopefully I'll be able to have these done before I need to go to get on the bus. It's Friday! Good news, my yellow hair dye is going to be coming in the mail today, so I'll be able to refresh my rainbow. It being Friday is good news enough. Some more good news, I completed my midterm today, so I don't have to fret over it all weekend. Bad news, I don't think I did very well on it. More good news, because it's the weekend, I can continue to... I can continue to carve this pumpkin. I'm gonna try to finish it today, so you can see what it looks like. It's gonna have these mandala, some more designs going down, and of course I'll have to save the seeds for those who want to eat them. Not me, I don't like pumpkin seeds. I'll see you when it's done. I already have an idea for one of them. I don't know what I'm going to do with the third one, but I'm pretty pleased with how this one turned out. Like, I'm... I didn't expect it to look so nice when lit up. It's a nice surprise. Took me a couple hours. Um, well, it took me more than a couple hours, but, um, I just sat here and finished the pumpkin. It took me about three or four hours today to finish it, because I had already started it, uh, earlier this week. But, yeah, that's what's going on with me. I've got quite a few things to do this weekend. Hopefully I'll be able to get caught up tomorrow. I've got to memorize some words, um, some Japanese words, as always. And um, I've really got to work on... <clears throat> I've really got to work on paying better attention in my Japanese culture and civilization class. So, that's a thing. So possibly after I wake up tomorrow, I'll just go to the coffee shop and stay there all day. And uh, work on my schoolwork. And since the coffee shop is like two blocks that away, I'll just come back here when I'm hungry. No big deal. Honestly, I really have no idea what this week looked like on vlog, so I hope it was interesting. This is the end of it. Um, today is Friday, like I said earlier, and I'm not gonna vlog tomorrow. I've got too many things to do, so I will see you in the next video. Ciao, ne!